Anna, we spent a lot of time not right for each other until we were. We matured together. You went from being my classmate, to being my friend, being my girl, to finally being the only thing I could see you as, my wife, my partner for life. Hannah, you're kind and very giving, not just to everyone, but especially to me. Oh, and I can ask for a lot sometimes, but you always find a way to make me happy. Well, Anthony, we're finally here. <laughs> uh, I can't believe the beautiful life that we have already created. Uh, today, you and I come together as one, as Taylor has stated. The days ahead of us will bring uh, both challenges, but also wonderful moments and all these memories that we will create. I vow to love you today, tomorrow, and every day from now on. You are my love, my strength, my partner. I love you. I love you so much. Now look at similarities between us and there's plenty. We perfectly complement each other when we have any differences or struggles. And I promise to be there for you always, anytime. We've gotten to enjoy the heck out of each other for so long now. So much we got a dang near perfect girl. I love you, Jade. But seriously, babe, the best part of my life is you. And just being there no matter what. I love you and I'm ready to spend the rest of my life with you. Family and friends, by the power vested in me, by the Universal Life Church and by the great state of Texas, I am pleased to announce Anthony and Hannah as husband and wife sealed together, both in law and in love. Anthony, you may now kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Fracasoro. great to have all of you here to witness the union of Hannah and Anthony as husband and wife before God. Together we will share in the joys of their wedding, both with the outward celebration of this occasion and with an internal appreciation for the love that surrounds us. Hannah and Anthony, you two have the opportunity to build an amazing life together. You are blessed to share this experience with the loved ones gathered here to support you as you embark on this journey together. As the Bible reminds us in Corinthians, Love is patient, love is kind, love does not envy, love does not boast. It is not proud, it is not rude, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, and always perseveres. Love never fails. May you remember this and cherish this ceremony, for on this day with love, we will forever bind Hannah and Anthony together. Hannah and Anthony, take a moment to sense the tremendous amount of love radiating throughout this space. As you stand here today, before God, and before those gathered here in your honor, and before one another, take note that after you speak your vows this day, your lives will never be the same. Marriage regardless of any preconceived notions you might have, has the capacity to deepen and challenge and strengthen you and your relationship in ways that you never thought possible. The joy you'll find as you pursue your shared lives will fuel you to face head-on challenges that you'll encounter on this earth. On your journey together, keep your spouse in the space of the highest priority in your heart. Continually learn to work together, to laugh together, and to love together. As your relationship strengthens, you will find that you come to share a remarkable love, a love that is both abundantly given and freely accepted. Marriage is one of life's greatest gifts, and it is a blessing to make these promises with your soulmate. As you hold on to one another, you will find deeper levels of joy, happiness, and peace 
together. 